T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, command engine start, 2, 1. Ignition. We have lift off. Shepard has cleared the tower. <laughs> and New Shepard has cleared the tower on our way to space with our first human crew. Go, Jeff, go, Mark, go, Wally, go, Oliver. You are going to space. When the speed hits zero, you know that they've hit Hapagee, their maximum altitude, and you hear they're having <laughs> quite an experience. The zero G piece may have been one of the biggest surprises because it felt so normal. It felt so like almost like we were as humans evolved to be in that environment, which I know is impossible, but it felt so serene and peaceful and the floating. This is incredible. And touchdown. Welcome back, New Shepherd's first human crew. Every astronaut, everybody who's been up into space, they say this, that it changes them and they look at it and they're kind of amazed and, and awestruck by the Earth and its beauty, but also by its fragility. And I can vouch for that. Um, when I look out, you know, when we're sitting in this room and when we're driving our cars and we're moving around the planet in our normal ways, the atmosphere is so gigantic. You know, we're these tiny little things and the planet, the atmosphere is so big. But when you get up above it, what you see is it's actually incredibly thin. It's this tiny little fragile thing. And as we move about the planet, we're damaging it.